For recipe notifications, do not forget to subscribe to Get Curried and click on the bell icon. Machher Jhol is a quintessential fish curry which is made in almost all Bengali homes. Well, Machher Jhol for the uninitiated is also a Bengali feature film in which Chef Devdutt makes almost a new version of fish curry for his ailing mother. Well, on that note, no points for guessing, let's make Machher Jhol. Hey guys, it's Varna Namdar and welcome to yet another episode of Khana Pina or Cinema. Well, there are various versions of making a fish curry Bengali style which is known as Machher Jhol as many versions, as many Bengalis, to be really clear and frank. Well, 80% of the recipe kind of remains the same. There's a little bit of a change here and there, but the process kind of remains the same. The first thing is to marinate the fish with turmeric powder and salt. Well, this curry generally has a little overdose of turmeric to begin with. We need to rub the turmeric and the salt really well. Well, this variety of fish is known as parche. You can use any sweet water fish, you can use rohu, you can use katla, you can use baked tea. The choice is yours. First things first, let's add in 2-3 to three large tablespoons of mustard oil. Allow this to heat well. Once the oil heats up, the first thing is to fry this fish. Well, most Bengali preparations begin with mustard oil and all the ingredients, rather 80-90% of the ingredients are fried, removed and then begins the real gravy or curry. After roughly a minute, we need to flip this over and fry this on the other side as well. Once this is fried well, time to remove this on a plate. And in the same oil, let's fry the potatoes. The potatoes are fried and done. Let's transfer these also on the plate. Let's transfer the pan back on the flame. Well, to begin this curry, you can use kalo jire or kalonji. You can begin with mustard, you can begin with jeera or cumin. But what I am doing today is beginning with onion paste. Saute this lightly. At this stage, you could also add in some ginger or garlic paste as you please. Like I said, there are many versions to a jhol or a fish curry. This is one of those. After sauteing the onions, time to add in tomato paste. Cook this lightly. On high flame, let's add in some spices. The first thing is turmeric powder, followed by just a touch of red chilli powder. And along with this, cumin powder. Let's give this a mix and cook this precisely for a minute on high flame. Let's add in some green chilies. You could slit these, you could cut these, I'm using them whole. And along with this, cupfuls of hot water. Time to add in some salt. Stir this well and allow this to cook on high flame for three to four minutes. And while doing that, also remember to slide in the potatoes. The curry has been boiling well and while boiling, it's also reduced to half. This is the perfect time to add in the fried fish. Give this a gentle stir and allow this to cook on medium flame for two to three minutes or till the fish and the potatoes are perfectly well cooked. Well, the fish and the potatoes are perfectly cooked. One final ingredient, and that is freshly chopped coriander. With this, your machher jhol is done and ready. And this, trust me, goes amazing with a bowl of hot steaming rice. With this, your quick, simple and easy recipe of Machir Jhol is done and ready. Make this for your loved ones, your family, friends. Do not forget to like and share the video, subscribe to Get Curried and continue watching Khana Pina or Cinema.